Hi, in this video, I'll show you how to download and install WordPress. So basically, I am on uh, the WordPress website, which is wordpress.org slash download. And you can see here, there is a button saying download WordPress 4.1. So you need to just click on it and it will download the latest version of uh, WordPress. You can save it on uh, one of the folders in your hard disk. Okay. So here I am saving it in a folder. It has been downloaded. So let me open the folder here. You can see here, this is what the file WordPress files are. So first of all, what you need to do is you need to extract the files. So it will extract all the files out here. So you need to be very careful with this step. If you don't do this right, your WordPress installation might just not work right the way you want it to. So then you open this folder and you can see here, here are all the files. So you select all of this, right click and click add to archive. So now your WordPress files have been archived and it is available here. So uh, if I am to re repeat the process, what you first need to do is you need to extract the files from the uh, zip file that you downloaded from the WordPress website. Once you've zipped it, you will find a folder called as WordPress. Go inside the folder, select all the files and then zip it again. So you have this file out here, which is a zipped file for the WordPress installation. Now we'll go to our hosting server and upload this file there. So let me quickly go into my Bluehost server. So here I am. Now I'm going to use a domain uh, which is uh, a, a domain that I registered recently but it is not for a food blog but I, it's a generic domain so I will go and show you how to go about installing WordPress uh, on that domain. Okay so here I am on my Bluehost uh, dashboard. So what I do is I first of all go to cPanel out here. Okay, so here is my cPanel. Now what I do is I first of all go into file manager out here it will open a pop-up window you can see here in the drop down you select the domain that you want to install WordPress on so I select the domain that I want to install it on and I click go it will open the file manager for that specific domain name you can see here this is the file manager these are some default files that you will find in all of the Bluehost uh, uh, Bluehost uh, you know server hosting server domain names so I go ahead and delete these files and once I have deleted this I will now have to upload the uh, WordPress installation that we just downloaded from the WordPress website so for that I go and click on browse I select the folder inside the folder here is a zip that we did so be careful not to upload this file. We had extracted the files and created another zip file inside this folder. So that is what you will want to select. So once you've selected that, the upload should start in a minute. So I'll pause the video and come back when the files, uh, when the file has been uploaded to the server. Okay, so the upload has been complete. You can see here that the WordPress files have been uploaded to our server. So now what we'll do is we'll go to the file manager again and we click on reload it will show that the zip file is uploaded here now we need to extract this file so you select this one and click on extract and it will extract the files here so that has extracted the files and you reload this page and you can see here that all the files have been extracted so now that's all about uh, uploading and uh, you know uh, extracting the file so now what we'll do is we'll move on to the five minute installation the famous five minute installation in wordpress uh, which will help us install our blog